All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching the Fate Grand Order, all trailers, promo promotional videos, and TVCMs, I think. Um, I don't know the specific order as to what they are in. I think they're in the correct order, um, but I just want to uh, give a shout out to this, this, this user right here um, for linking the playlist for this. Um, I did download the videos just because I was having major problems with playlists and uh, recording, etc. Um, but the, it will say the, the name of the current video playing up top, just so you know which is which. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to see all of these. It's probably going to be a long video, although there are some videos in the playlist that are like 16 seconds long, I think. Um, but yeah, we'll uh, we'll see how the reactions to this go. But I'm looking forward to it regardless. I've seen some Grand Order content before. I can't remember which, but it was probably just snippets. And honestly, the animation and stuff is hella cool. Um, but yeah, if you like the video, please like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this right now. Okay, so starting with the announcement trailer. All right. So this was the, the first trailer, and I think this came out in 2017. Uh, for some reason, I, I thought the game was a lot older, but apparently it came out in 2017. So it doesn't seem to be much uh, animation or anything like that at all in this in this trailer. Oh, this is Jan. Okay. But it, I guess it is just kind of an announcement for the game. I was explaining all the Holy Grail was Emperor of Rose, Voyager of the Storm, Knights of Londinium, okay. Fifth Holy Grail War of the White Robe. Sixth would be Camelot, right? Yeah. Seventh Babylonia. Absolutely the demonic front. Yes, sir. Oh, we got something here. The greatest holy girl war in human history, uh, human history begins. Hell yes, dude. So the fact that this came out in 2017, I think it was summer 2017, and then Babylonia came out in 2019. That's crazy how fast they adapted something, to be fair. Okay, nice. First trailer all the way. Next up, third singularity, Okinos. Ok 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 I can't pronounce that, I'm sorry. Mm, okay, oh, so that was like the, the kind of pirate ship looking one from uh, Solomon. 1888. Oh, this one's set in London. Ah, so this is the fourth Holy Grail? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fourth Singularity. Next up, Garden of Sinners Grand Order Collaboration. Hmm. Oh, shit. God, it looks so good. Um, yeah, these trailers are super short. You can't even, can't even get a good chance to actually react, but... God, this they, they look so good. Before the dawn of modern modern America. Oh, okay, so this one's set in America. Or before America, I suppose. And that was the fifth singularity. Interesting. Fate Assel Zero. Okay. Is it something to do with Fate Zero or not? Because MASH is here, so... We definitely have some characters from Fate Zero, though. Oh, and this Camelot, yes, sir. There's a lot here that actually wasn't in the film. Maybe it's just for the promotional video. Hmm, okay. Oh, and this Seven Singularity, Babylonia. Yes, let's go. Oh, 
Same again with the sixth uh, promotional video. It's just nothing that it's actually included in the film. Cool. Oh, not the film, the, the series, sorry. New chapter, Fake Grand Order, Epic of Remnant. Okay. This is going to be like the announcement trailer where there's not much to show at the moment. So what's this like a a new chapter to Grand Order or is it like a DLC or something or I wonder what it is. Definitely seems like a big event within Grand Order. In the fact that it's getting this only kind of announcement trailer like this. Shinjuku Phantom Incident. Two. Women of Agatha. Okay. Seven Jewels of Sword Masters. Heretical Solemn. Bro, it's such an interesting storyline. I wish they'd adapt more. I don't know if I'm like a four by it, but I don't know if it's worth actually getting into Grand Order at this point, like the mobile game. I, I much prefer like the anime stuff. Mm -hmm. Remnants that the Mage King left behind. Grand Order. Ooh, damn. Oh, it is a new chapter then. Wow. Very cool. Interesting looking characters right there. I'm not on YouTube, so I don't have the dates of when all this came out, but, uh, yeah. What's going on here? There's so many cool-looking characters. My god. I need to know all of them. I need to know who they are. There's a Suedo singularity. Extra CCC. Oh, I actually know this. I haven't seen anything of it, but I've, I've... I, you know what I mean? I've seen it before. I've seen some of these characters. By the way, there are a lot of characters in Fate that I have, or Grand Order, that I actually have seen. Just from like Twitter or just seeing them advertised in places, but I, I don't know who they are. I don't know the names or anything. Oh, there's a singularity too of this kind of new chapter. This is Singularity 3. So it's like we went through all of the singularities and then this new chapter. So maybe, so is this what's going to come after Solomon now? Like now that this, that kind of, those singularities are over? I feel like I'm spoiling myself here. I don't know. There's Singularity 4. So I guess I've got these and the, these trailers in the right order then. This goddamn. I forgot his name. Got a top hat dude. I betrayed them. Got his name. It's confusing as to where all this is set in the timeline of Grand Order. Cosmos and the Lost Belt, like, I swear that's uh, special or lost, something in the Lost Belt. I swear I've, I've, I've definitely watched that. But, but again, where does this fit into the timeline? 
だけの話だ。我が名はソロモン。Oh, ソロモン。未来を見渡す目を通して、この結末を予期したんだ。そして、人類の最後の戦いに、自分より見届けるものか。空想の。Again, this is like, this seems like a big event. If、uh, there's not much kind of animation being shown, the Grand Duchess of the Beast Nation, Lost Belt One. It definitely seems like a new chapter. Something of Everlasting Flame. 1000 BC. Okay, so it tells you when they're set. 0210 BC. Hmm. Lost Belt Four, the final Dark God. 11,900. What? So is this like one that's set in the future? That's cool. The day to bring down gods, 12,000 BC. Wow. Planet is born, round table domain. Ooh, okay. And then this is just question marks. Ooh, that, one, that one's interesting. What is this? <laughs> After the incineration of humanity, an unprecedented quest for the Holy Grail begins. Hmm. Feel free, guys, to explain kind of the timeline as to when all these events are set. Obviously, no spoilers if、uh, there is more fake content to come in the future for anime only. Like myself.、Mm, okay. Okay, so this is Lost Belt 1. Oh, very cool. Oh, so we know we saw that dude. Is this like set in Moscow or something? I wonder who would anime all these. Whether,、um, I, presumably, with it being Grand Order, Cloverworks would stick with it. I think that'd be awesome if Cloverworks could stay animating these. Assembled of heroic spirits this time. I want to get the kind of video. Oh, this is Fate Apocrypha. Okay. I've, I've obviously seen this, but I haven't watched it. So apologies for that. But no, I haven't watched this one. Grand Order. What's this one about? Oh, is it just a general, like, fake Grand Order trailer? Okay. Lost Belt 2. Ooh. This one looks more like a futuristic one. Maybe. I don't know. The thing I love about Fate is like you see all these characters and they're like, hmm, I wonder who you are. And then you find out like who they're supposed to be from history and it's like, oh, that's really cool. Legend of the Imperial Cap Capital Grail.、Mm. So good, and the sound is amazing as well.、Oh. Who is it that animates these,、um, these kind of promotional videos then? Do they have their own kind of studio for this, or do they get Ufotable or Cloverworks to do it? Lost Belt Free? Okay. There is just so much room for adapted story. This could go on for so long, but like,、oh, I bet this story is just so good. They need to put money into like adapting these. Goddamn. 
Is this Tokugawa's Labyrinth? Okay. Seems different. Is like a, some kind of DLC to one of the Lost Belts, maybe? Great Requiem. Ooh. This one looks nice. Grand Order X Fate Requiem. Hmm. Interesting. Was that, that was a board game. Lost Bell 4. Ooh. Bro, look at this. Oh. Oh, that's like some future shit right there. Yo, this is anime. It's so nice, bro. Holy crap. Cosmos in the Lost Belt. Shit is insane visuals wise. Las Vegas Championship match. Okay. The, the, what, they do like a. Like a match in Vegas or something? That's cool. Guda Guda Final Honoji. Oh, is this character again? Or like, is one related to them? There's so much information to take on in all these trailers. But I'm liking what I'm saying. Honoji. Figure under the fourth anniversary. Ooh, this one will be good. Damn, this looks gorgeous. Oh my god, this one looks hella nice. Tell me you focus about anime at this one. It looks so good. Oh, the sound effects, dude. Holy shit. So many cool looking her heroic spirits, bro. That shit looks real. What? Wow. Jesus, the CG work is so good. Wow. Saber Wars 2. Ooh. Ishtar. Nice. Oh, she's a bounty hunter. What? Ashtar. Saber Wars 2. Wow. Oh, it's like a Christmas event. Cool. Olympus. This one looks good. That's some wacky shit going on here. So that's not like its own singularity? It's like, a, oh no, that's Lost Bell number five. Or is that? This is Lost Bell number five. Ah, okay. Bro, this looks so good. I remember in Babylonia we saw like uh, like little snippets from previous singularities that you know obviously weren't animated. I think I saw I remember the one on like a ship. So that must be from this. Or maybe not this, but like previous singularity in the previous chapter. 
Oh, Grand Order 5th Anniversary. Wow, we're already at the 5th one. I feel like the anniversary videos are probably the best, like, best bits. Ooh. Wow, everybody looks so good. <laughs> Who's this character? Was oh, that Mordred? Ah, uh, my boy. Let's go. So cool, man. So much good shit. Mash. Thank you to all masters. Oh, that's so cool, man. Imaginary scramble. Mm. Are these ones like, is it all kids? What is it? Oh, this one looks dark. Void space naval battle. Nautilus. Oh. That one looked dark. Definitely. Guda Guda. Oh, these, so these are like yearly events, and I think this is the third one we've watched. Hmm. Is it the same one? Oh no, it's like an extended version. In like the uh, question, in like these um in these trailers when you first see them, do the voice actors stay the same for when they're like adapted into anime? Like if there's one of, for example, like Ishtar, um, like does that voice actor stay the same or is there no promotional videos? It's this one. Summer 2020. Oh, nice. This is like the beach episode of <laughs> the mobile game. Lost Belt 5.5. Okay. They, they go so hard just for like trailers bro it is so crazy half of these trailer fights would be like in the running for top anime fights of the year if they were actually adapted <laughs> oh another christmas one I know it's, as it goes along as well, there's like so many new characters that like the ones we know, like the Saber and Ishtar and all that from the old, they're just like not shown as much anymore. Oh, this is like an idol one. <laughs> nice. Lost Belt 6. Wow. So cool. Oh, there's like an extended part of it as well. Some different voices, I suppose. The Fairy Round Table Realm, Avalon Le Fay. Wow. Oh, it's the same realm. 
Oh, I saw my boy Lancer there for a second, I think. Oh, there's so many for this one. Maybe in like 10 years we'll have all this animated. Who knows? Who knows? What's this one? Lost Bell 6 Free. Fairies who love freedom. Oh, so this is like another Camelot version then. Maybe? Oh, this is like forever in the future from Camelot though, it looks like. This one was in 2021. Hmm. Okay. Oh, sixth anniversary. Nice. This is the most recent one then, presumably? I don't know when the anniversary falls on, what date it falls on. Music's good. It's just showing everything from the main singularities, or is it like these from Lost Belt, or... I'm, I'm just assuming this is how it works, so if I've mentioned something that's incorrect, just feel free to correct me on uh, what actually is the order to these things. I feel like this anniversary trader is more just kind of it's more memories from the previous ones put into kind of mash I suppose as opposed to kind of original content not to say it's still not a good trailer though そして、そう信じてくれた人がいたのです。選定される世界で人々とつながる思い。is this really like the story of mash obviously the story of the player too oh Shit, what is that? The giant laser? What? What is that from? Into the next story. So is, it, is there going to be another game, or is it just talking about a new chapter, or...? I like how much these trailers kind of involve you as the player as well. I think that's really cool. Summer 2021. <laughs> this one looks good. 
Is that Da Vinci? Oh, it's a Halloween. Well, oh, it's like a magical girl thing. What is that? Oh, no, it's not. It's like Cinderella. Oh. Another good Gouda. Okay. Tunguska Sanctuary. I was lost about 6.5. Bro. Some of these characters look so sick. Oh my god. I mean, most of them do. So it's, it'd be so hard to pick favorites. I don't know how people have favorites in these games. So many cool characters. Alright, so that was my reaction to Fate, Grand Order, all... Uh, promotional videos etc so far trailers um i think so far i think that has all of the most up to date i don't know i was only sent the playlist um but yeah maybe i'll react to some more kind of fake grand order or fake content in the future um if you guys have any up have any ideas please let me know because i love 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 fate and uh, i want to see more of it um but yeah anyway guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i certainly did enjoy all the content uh, i want to thank you guys so much for watching have a nice rest of your day and peace out